Hey guys, find me a new, um, uh, an old, new, three horsepower Brig. Look, I got the little thin tank on it. Um, I've been needing a motor for the uh, Rupp converted to a little Indian mini bike for a while now. Finally stumbled across one yesterday. I'm down here at this restaurant eating breakfast. And guy owns a go-kart track down the road here. I asked him if he, had, if he knew where I could find a good three horse Briggs. He said, yeah, I do. He said, I got one. He said, Bro. I said, uh, is, is, is it run good? He said, it's brand new. He said, it ain't never done nothing but um, but sit. He said, it's an older one. He said, but it's brand new. And I said, well, how did that happen? He said, well, it's on an edger. You know, it's made to edge, um, edge sidewalks, driveways, you know, for to keep grass, you know, cut the little ridge around the edge of the driveways and stuff. He said, uh, he said, it ain't never been run none at all. He said, take $50 for it, Rick. I said, well, if it's what you say it is, consider it mine. Went out there and looked at it, and I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw that it was a thin gas tank. Buddy, you talk about a sweetheart of a running motor. Uh, it's got the kill switch. I had to buy, had to cut the, uh, you know, when you cut the fuel off on it, it, um, it dies because it's got the uh, kill switch wire that runs to the throttle system and it kept it kept dying on me while ago and I thought wait a minute now I stood up there and watched this thing run yesterday on the edger and it run great so um, took it back apart took the wire loose and uh, idles now like it's supposed to uh, took me took me longer than I thought to figure out what was wrong with it, it took me 10 or 15 minutes it finally dawned on me what the problem was um, I'm going to crank it and let you see how easy this bad boy is to crank, but it'll take me a minute to cut it off because, see, I don't have any way of killing it except touching a screwdriver to that wire. Watch this. If you, you want to see something crank with almost effortless. Watch this. I hope you can still see it. If you ever in your life seen one crank that easy, I never have. Finger sewing machine. I got lucky. You don't run across many like this, you know, in the fifty-dollar range. This motor ain't even broke in yet. Put some fresh gas in it. Let me see if I can get it, kill it here now. That ain't too hard to do. I will mount a kill switch up on the handlebars. Kill it with when needed. Um, the only thing about it was. It is the short shaft on that trimmer. All it had was a little V pulley on it, and it's not long enough. I'm gonna have to do some doctoring right there, just like I did on another one I've got. Probably gonna have to go to the junkyard, get a bad three horse, cut the tip off the the um, crankshaft, and weld it like I did the little gold. Turned out perfect. You wouldn't think you could get it straight, but you can if you try. Do a little filing, a little grinding, you can get it to do that. Well, there you go guys I'm tickle pink not only do now I have a look-alike of a true little Indian but I've got the regular motor that went with them during their era similar to you know to when they were you know proud of it it's becoming my favorite mini bike even over the green one even over the little yellow taco but um, they'll all be my favorites y'all have a good day and I uh, hope you enjoyed seeing the update adios for now